What's going on YouTube and welcome back to the Cotton 68 SBC channel. Guys, tonight I wanted to share a new product with you that I've been using here for the past six months. The product's from a company called Precision Armament and it happens to be their AccuWasher. Now in the past when dealing with muzzle brakes and muzzle devices, trying to time them is a pain in the ass. Crush washers don't really crush and peel washers really don't peel. In my opinion, they both suck. Which set me out on a quest to find something easier. While I was out there searching the web, I ran into this company and decided I'd give it a try, and I'm really glad I did. Basically, what you get when you order their AccuWasher system is a series of 18 AccuWashers, going from thick to thin. And all of them are designated by little tick marks that are on the side of the washer and I'll actually put a picture of that so you guys can see what it looks like up close but when you order the kit it's about 25 bucks and I know that crush washers and pill washers but for 25 bucks on average you can do nine different muzzle devices so you're actually saving money by going with this system so I'll get everything set up and quit yapping here and show you just how you install the Precision Armament AccuWasher system to get your muzzle device correctly timed. Alright guys, so today we're going to install the Silencer Co. Saker brake onto my 6.8 Bison Armory rifle. Now the instructions inside the AccuWasher pack, uh, the instructions are very clear, they're easy to read, and easy to understand. Basically what you want to do is start out with the thickest washer and to have three bow tick marks on it and three fine tick marks on it. And that's going to be your biggest washer. So you want to take that washer, put it over your threads like you would any crush washer or pill washer. Alright guys, so once you got your Accu washer on, you want to go ahead and install the muzzle device you're trying to time and you just want to do that hand tight for right now you really don't want to torque anything down just get it snug with your hand as you can see here I'm out of time these ports actually need to be perfectly sideways now to get that to happen this port needs to come all the way around to here about 320 degrees so what you're doing is you're sighting down your barrel looking at your muzzle device and you want to go clockwise to see how far it'll take to get your ports timed correctly alright so I know in a clockwise motion I need to come around about 320 degrees to get my ports to line up the way they need to now if I use the instructions from Precision Armament and use the chart that they provide, I go down through the chart and I find the three, 320 degrees. And beside 320 degrees, it'll tell me which AccuWasher I need based on the number of ticks. And this is the one I need to use. It has three fine tick marks on it. Take your muzzle device back off. Take the big Accu washer back off. And reinstall your muzzle device. And then you're going to torque that down whatever the torque value for your device is. And as you guys can see, my muzzle device is now properly timed. And I've shot quite a few rounds through the 6.8 here, and I have not had this muzzle device loosened in any way the AccuWasher system locks it in really, really tight. 
We'll say the only thing that I can say bad about the AccuWasher system is that it uh, comes in gray. You can't get them in black. I talked to the company. They said in order to make them black, because it's such a precision process that they use to make these, you would actually have to be paying upwards to $50 a pack. I think the $25 price is right in line where it needs to be. So you can, if you don't like the silver look, which I actually happen to like, you can just take some flat back paint and paint the outside of this. Uh, you do not want to paint anything on the inside surfaces. That will cause your degrees to be off. Like I said, it's a very precision process that they use on their machining. So you do not want to put anything on the sides of your AccuWatch. Guys, if you have any questions or comments about it, please leave them down in the comment section. And uh, I'll try to answer them the best I can. But for now, let's go out and do a little shooting. All right, guys, we're out here at the farm. Wanted to give you all uh, some shots of the gun being shot with the precision armament, AccuWasher on it. Uh, all together, I've probably got, I would say, four to 500 rounds through the 6.8 uh, using this AccuWasher system. I haven't had any problem with it backing off. Uh, really, really solid. Uh, once you get it tightened up and snugged down, it's not going to come back off there. And uh, for the price that you pay for these washers, considering that you can do on the average nine guns, I don't think you can beat this. Uh, I'll quit yakking and we'll take some shots. We'll take uh, four or five without a silencer, then we'll put the silencer on there. Don't need these anymore. There you guys go. From Precision Armament, that's the, called the AccuWasher. I'll leave the links down in the description below. Please go check them out, and I'll probably have them annotated somewhere here in the video. For uh, 25 bucks, you get enough washers to do on the average nine guns. You can't beat that price. You don't have to deal with a stupid crush washer or a pill washer. It's just an, a great, innovative product. And as always, hope you guys are having a great week, and we'll talk at you later.